So I've heard the story that it's starting your kitchen or your apartment. Uh, actually, the balcony. Uh, Eric, Bill, me, and um, what? No, no. We, 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 we dragged Rob in later. It was, um, oh, I'm black from Seattle. Um, Alex Knight. Tried to drag Alex Knight in, who, was, uh, who, who continues to be a greatly talented guy and wanted him to be the fourth, but I don't think he had quite the guts to jump over the balcony with us. Yeah. How did you guys fund it? Or how, how so you started in your balcony? Or your, did you raise venture money? I actually or? had funding, I think, when I called these guys. I had... Um, I think I had gotten a commitment for uh, ten million dollars. Pretty good, huh? Yeah. Well, that that didn't work out so well. Uh, as as the as a bunch of as a bunch of abouters know. So I had a commitment. I was I was doing some consul consulting um, um, for OpenText, the the uh, search engine company under uh, that was the, Yahoo's first search engine. And they said, "What do you want to do?" And I said, "I want to do this." And they said, "Great. Here's we just did an IPO." Um, uh, Yahoo just went public for a whopping $700 million. They pay us about a million, which they're not really paying us. So we'll give you $10 million bucks. And great. So then, you know, yeah. uh, a unique kind of a start. Until one day they said, well, mm, we changed our mind. Um, we were able um, to uh, convince them to turn the 10 guaranteed equity into a $4 million non-convertible, I think it was non-convertible. I don't know if you remember, Rick, my, my, my lawyer brother. I think it was actually non-convertible into, wow. in, into a straight loan for a variety of reasons. Um, None of which we can talk about. <laughs> you'll, you'll, you'll have, I don't think I can even acknowledge that open text exists. Well, it's, it's a, it's, it's, <laughs> that, that, Get Bill some more beer. The, the, <laughs> actually, flaming shots are preferred. Um, <laughs> But uh, so we had so we, we had four million. It, it was, yeah. it was it, actually we had a bunch of people already working because we were drawing on the assumed ten million, um, and I think we probably had about twenty people when we had the meeting in White Plains in our White Plains office where we said we're screwed. Uh, everybody sit tight. We'll you know we'll figure it out. Yeah. And we were then able to convert it into four million. But it was a loan. And as you know, as a VC, VCs will never put money in behind a loan because these guys really meant to take the money back. Yeah. Um, so we then, we then got um, a bunch of VCs who had faith in us who actually put the next four in as a loan. So we're sitting there now with $8 million in loans. Completely unheard of. Wow. Um, and then we were that close to getting $4 million in revenue from MSN who wanted our media metrics ranked. So we were going to change our URL to miningcode.msn.com. That deal was done. It was a handshake. Well, it didn't happen. Uh, so then we, you know, I crawled back to the VCs and said I was really only kidding. We, you know, we were, would have owned all the company, et cetera. Uh, and we converted everything into, so if you take a look at the fact sheet and it says Series A and things like that, not so much. You know, in terms of just, you know, the, 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 be flexible. This, this, you know, we, it, it was... You know, it was it was a strange financing, as a lot of them are. Yeah. Uh, but I think that our strange financing, and as I know you'll probably ask us later, um, I, I think that first one when we called everyone together and said, "We're screwed, but we'll be okay. Hang tight." Yeah. I think that was one. You know, if you think of the dozen things that that made it work, it was the fact that everyone said, "Okay." 